Keeping your kidneys warm in the winter is incredibly important, not only to feeling warm all over, but also to your health. One method I've come up with is the wool blanket kidney belt. If you're interested in hearing more about it, keep watching. So I don't know about you, but I find that when I'm out in the winter and I'm doing a lot of work and I start to perspire, when I start to cool down, I really start to feel it in my lower back. And that's especially true if I'm not wearing a long coat that goes well down to my thighs or if I'm bending over a lot and I'm exposing my lower back to the cold air. It really starts to ache there. So I started to do a little research and what I found is that this is not uncommon. In fact, it has a long history of being something that's been important to people's health as well as staying warm. It's very popular in Asia to wrap yourself up around your midsection as well as in Europe so that you stay warm and keep your kidneys warm doesn't seem to be so popular in North America. Well, I started to look at ways of doing that. And what I found, one of the most popular ways, is a thing called a kidney belt. So I have this section of wool blanket left from the projects I've been doing. I decided to see if I could make one. Let me show you what I came up with. Nothing special, just a piece of wool blanket cut to a specific size. And I'll show you how I arrived at that size in a second. But it, this one turns out to be nine inches in width here. I'm not going to tell you how long it is, but I will show you on myself and how you can measure one out for yourself. I used a belt that I had hanging in my closet that I wasn't using any longer. You could use other methods of bringing it together around the front, but I chose the belt because it was something I already had and wasn't using. I sewed two pockets onto the inside of it, made again from other sections of wool blanket that I had left over. And these two pockets are designed to do two things. One, it gives me an extra layer of wool right over my kidneys for a little bit more protection. But the pockets are open on the ends, as you can see, and that allows me to take these small instant hand warmers and slide one down inside on each side and place right over my kidneys and what a lot of warmth that provides. All right, that's all there is to the design of this. Very simple, that's why I didn't show making it from the wool blanket from scratch. It just goes together quite easily. Now, let's put it on. I'll show you how to size one for yourself. All right, so I have the kidney belt on and what I'm gonna do is lower the camera down so you'll be able to see what it looks like on me and I'll be able to give you an idea of how to size one for yourself. So let me lower the camera. Okay, so what I had done is I made or measured around my waist to just forward of my hips, gave myself a little extra material because of course it's always easy to cut off excess uh, blanket later, but it's hard to put it back on. So I gave myself a little excess material. I didn't bring it all the way together. You can do that. And the belt I used is only one way of bringing this together. You can use any number of different methods. You could use Velcro, I'm sure. There's elasticized bands, belts, whatever you want to do. This was just very cheap, very inexpensive because it was something I already had, something I wasn't using. So I wanted it to come forward of my hips a little bit, and I wanted it to extend on my back from my tailbone to my ribs. So for most people, that's eight to 10 inches. And I decided to split the difference and go with nine inches. So there it is. That's all there is to it. It's not very fancy. It's nothing very special looking. It's very compact and you don't even notice it wearing under a jacket or, or a coat. It's very lightweight, very comfortable, but what a difference it makes for keeping your whole body warm, especially in my lower back area. So that's it. Another wool blanket project. Small, compact, easy to make. I think if you give this a try, you'll agree. It does a lot for keeping your whole body warm. Okay, that's all I have for you today. If you have any questions or comments on this project or any other project you'd like you to see me make out of the wool blankets, then put them in the comment section below. But until next time, get out and explore and take that path less traveled. It'll make all the difference. Bye for now.